What's up, this is MLB Talk 1, 2, 3. All right, uh, this is, I believe, uh, the day before the last day of June. I'm not sure here, but um, uh, July 4th coming up. But there's been three, um, you know, pretty, not, you know, huge release stories, but, you know, some players that were signed or kept in the offseason. Now, um, the first one I want to talk about is the Arizona Diamondbacks have released Melvin Mora. Um, if you're going to be uh, releasing players um, and making room on your roster, um, because Melvin Moore, you can't you know send him down. So you're either going to release him or you're going to keep him at this point. And so they have released Melvin Mora. Uh, he hit just 230 in 134 plate appearances. Um, Ryan Roberts is having a big year. They signed him for $2 million in the offseason, and they still have to pay for the rest of the salary for this year. But um, overall, what this tells me is that, number one, they don't need the roster space, which could hint to a number of things. Um, that they feel that they could get more production out of someone from AAA, or um, I'm not exactly sure about the Diamondbacks. Maybe they have someone injured that they're coming up, and that's, that's the... Absolute only player that they could get rid of at the time, or um, number three, they're thinking of making a trade, or they're going to be close to a trade, or they feel confident about making a deal um, because they wouldn't be well, they probably would, but they probably, uh, if you're releasing a player at this point, you're probably trying to create roster space for um, a trade or whatever. I'm sorry, my eyes really messed up. Um, but so anyway, the Diamondbacks, the Arizona Diamondbacks, have released Melvin Moore, who is one of their many free agent signings. Not a huge one in the winter, but a signing, and they have released him today. So um, just want to report that, and thank you for watching. I will be talking one, two, three.